And we're back here at Pro Wrestling Battleground. Marvelous Matt Nix taking on the debuting in Rob Matter. A giant of a man, or at least in his ego he is. Both of these guys, Kyle, coming in from freelance pro wrestling here at Pro Wrestling Battleground. Nice mix of new guys, out of town guys coming in here, spotlight here at Walebski's Blue Saloon. Yeah, Matt Nix has been here previously. He's one half of the four-star heroes, but was with his tag team partner, Chris Castro, and they had an impressive victory over the odd couple tag team of Harvey Bauer and Marcus Crane. Harvey Bauer and Marcus Crane we've seen here in the past at Battleground several times. And uh, here tonight we're gonna see Nix take on Matter. See if Matter can make a big impression here in his debut in Battleground. Another tie up. Matter thinking he's got the strength advantage, but not, not quite. I saw Rob Matter here earlier tonight at Lebski's in the locker room. By the we got some mirrors in the locker room. He was looking in the mirror, looking at himself like he's a giant talking to himself how big he is. And here he goes, test the strength he's calling for. Out here, Walewski is actually behind Rob Matter in the test of strength. They want to see it. Now, Matt Nix might not be the biggest guy here in Battleground, but he's definitely got a size advantage against the giant Rob Matter. Quickly leaves that test of strength. Looking, looking for a leverage advantage up there. Come on, Goku Nerd, let's go. Man, next can't believe it. And the test of strength again goes towards Matt Nix, pulls him off. Bomb strike into it. Atomic drop. That'll take you down no matter what your size. Duck the line into the front headlock. Rob Matter gets out of it, has a wrist lock, control the wrist now. Ring in the arm. Fireman's carry, hook of the leg, hook of the arm. Only a two count, holds on. Matt Nick smartly holds on to that wrist. Still, hold, still in control of Rob Matter. And as we saw in that pinfall there, referee Harry Gryffindor kind of took a little bit long to get down to that pinfall. I think he was caught up in the technical wrestling that we're seeing here between these two in Pro Wrestling Battleground. Brings him down to the ground. Just whipping him down right to the ground with that arm right here. Followed up with an arm drag. Arm drag, two. 
Misses on the third. Misses on the knee. Airplane spin here in Walewski's Blue Saloon. Matters down. Matt Nix uses the ropes. Kick to the head. Quick roundhouse kick, and this match could be over. Kick out by Rob Matter barely got his shoulder up. It's amazing the accuracy that Matt Nix has with that kick. Especially after spinning around in the center of the ring that many times. I heard a crowd count of six. It might have been even up more than that, up to 10 full rotations possibly. Oh! And the giant Rob Matter pulls the feet out from underneath Matt Nix. Rob Matter showing a little more attitude. Matt Nix on his back now, on his shoulders. Foot across the throat, he doesn't need that. He may be a giant, but he doesn't need to step on Matt Nix's throat. Matt Nix was on his back, staring at the lights. Bird spinning in his head. All Matter had to do was get in the ring, hook the leg, walk out of here a winner, but instead he insisted on choking Matt Nix, dropping some elbows now. Stomping away now after the elbows. Senton, the giant rock matter. Did you notice though on that lateral press there, there's some good wrestling coming in from Rob Matter. He put his forearm, put the bone across the face in the jaw of Matt Nix. So not only did he have to work the kick out, but he had a forearm in his face in the process. The Giant couldn't get Matt Nix up in the scoop slam there though. Palm strikes to the chest. Repeated palm strikes. Like e Honda. Oh, oh big palm this. strike. Using his inner energy there. Oh! Two feet driving him into the mat. Great move there. Defensive maneuver with the jackknife pin. Rob Matter only gets a two count though. Yeah, double foot stop kind of similar to Christian Rose's dubstep. And just as effective. with those sliding kicks to the stomach. <laughs> Marvelous man Nix has to uh, come back somehow. Oh, kick, kick to, to the, the kick to the jaw takes him down. I don't know if there's gonna be much of a comeback from Matt Nix after that. Still keeps fighting though, gets his shoulder up, Kyle. He's still in this match, working his way to his knees. Double chops to the side of the ribs. Big left hand there. Knee to the chest. What's he looking for here? Calling for a Batista bomb on that Nix. Matter going for all the, the big moves. Maybe looking Air for a kryptonite crush. Oh. Air raid crash, you might call it. Drops him. Both men are down. The effects of that double stomp in the corner from Rob Matter are still, still lingering with Matt Nix. He's using the corner to pull himself up. Ducks the line, hits the ropes. Oh, Left line from. Just grabs him, throwing the giant around. German suplex. Both men's shoulders are down, though. Just a two count, though, says Harry Gryffindor. Positioning Rob Matter for something here. Says he's going up top. We haven't seen too much off the top here tonight in Battleground. Off the second, misses the moonsault, though. Knees and thighs hit the mat. He was lucky he didn't hit his face on the mat. I don't, whoa. Some sort of a backbreaker from Rob Matter. Matt Nix gets his shoulder up though. Jumping back and back 
backbreaker. Very innovative maneuver there from Rob Natter, but it didn't get the job done, and he's going to have to stay on his opponent. I believe Rob Natter is calling for a choke slam. He claims to be a giant wrestler, so that's a staple in the offense of giant wrestlers, but I don't think he's going to be able to get Matt Nix off his feet like that. And there we go. Elbow to the arm, pump kick. Scoops him up. A backbreaker and still driving his head into the mat. Hooks the leg. And there we go. In his second match in pro wrestling battleground, Matt Nix picks up the win on the giant Rob Matter.